Hi Kai, today we are going to create another useful console app. We are going to make a console app that will convert our image files. Let's begin. Open Visual Studio and create a new console application and name it Convert Image Files and ensure that Do Not Use Top Level Statements is ticked. Once the program is created, delete the existing code. Then in Project Properties, set the target OS to be Windows. Now we are ready to add the code to convert our image files. We are now ready to accomplish our task. There are a number of ways to convert image files. And there are a number of third-party libraries available in Visual Studio 2022. One such library is called the Image Magic. We are going to use this library to convert our image files. One advantage of this library is that it supports large image file conversion. To accomplish our task we need to do the following. Firstly, we need to read the file names from the folder containing our images into a list. Secondly, we need to loop through each image file and convert the image into new format. Here is the code to do this. First we need to add NuGet package references to our project using the NuGet package manager like this. Right mouse button click on the project and select manage NuGet packages option from the list. Click on the Browse tab. Search for Image Magic in the search box. Select the first item in the list. And install the package. We are now ready to go through the code. First, we need to declare few variables. We need an images folder path that has all the images that we want to convert. We need an output images folder path where we will save the converted image files. We need a convert from file type, which will store the file type we want to convert from. Here we are setting it to .jpg file type. We also need a convert to file type, which will store the file type we want to convert to. Here we are setting it to .png file type. We then use the directory .getfiles method to get all the file paths from this folder and store it into a list, like this. We then check if the list is empty, if so we exit this method. We then check if output images folder path exists, if not we create it. Now we create a dictionary of the supported file types. Like so. We are just interested in the following file types, .jpg, .png, and .bmp. You can add other files types you need here. Now we loop through each image file in the list. At the start of the loop we take each file and create a magic image file. We wrap the magic image file inside and using statement, like so. Using statement ensures resources are disposed of, even when program crashes. We then create a new file path for the converted image, using the current file path information. Firstly we get the file path from the current file without the file extension. We then use the path combine method to create a new file path for the converted image, like so. We then use the dictionary to get the selected file type to convert to. Like this. And finally apply the conversion, like so. If the file type is not supported, we just write out console message to say file type is not supported. Now we are ready to run the program. Before we run the program, let's check our source image folder. It currently has 10.jpg files. The target folder is empty. When we run the program, we should expect the target folder to contain .png files. Let's now run the program and see if that is the case. Run the application.
Now check the target folder. It should now contain .png files. And it does. So our program has correctly converted .jpg file to .png file. That's it. We have now made a console app that will convert our image files. Simple, wasn't it? The complete code is available in the description. You can copy-paste it into your project.